Now, Boris Johnson has not ruled out a further relaxation of immigration rules to help ease the UK's fuel and supply shortages. But the Prime Minister insisted he does not want to see a return to a lot of low-wage immigration. Amid the continuing queues at petrol stations across the country, the government has said 300 fuel tanker drivers will be able to come to the United Kingdom from overseas immediately. This is under a bespoke temporary visa, which will last until March. Some 4,700 other visas intended for foreign food haulage drivers will be extended beyond the uh, initially announced three months. They will last from late October to the end of February. I would say that they should go about their business in the, the normal way, insofar as they possibly can. I appreciate how frustrating it has been, how infuriating it, it has been uh, for people. Uh, the situation is uh, is stabilising, but it's a, it's, a, it's a problem that has been driven really by uh, demand, not by supply. Though obviously we're taking all the precautions that we can. What we have now is a, a, a system that allows us to, to control uh, immigration, and that gives us flexibility we can we can open up uh, our markets if we need to and of course we'll keep everything under review but what we don't want to do is go back to a, a situation in which we basically allowed the road haulage industry to be sustained uh, with a lot of low-wage uh, immigration that meant that wages didn't go up and, and, and facilities standards the quality of the job didn't go up hello Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.